This is NOAA Weather Radio. All hazards. Station WXL 42 operating on frequency 162.40 megahertz. This program originates from the National Weather Service in Raleigh and is transmitted from an antenna located on Sorotown Mountain in Phelps County. The station serves the northwest Piedmont and northern foothills of North Carolina as well as adjacent Virginia counties. Here is the latest weather synopsis. A cold front will move southeast across the region this evening and overnight. Behind the front, strong and cold high pressure will build into the area Thursday and Friday with sudden freezing temperatures at night. The high will shift east and temperatures will moderate during the weekend and into the upcoming work week. Here is the latest National Weather Service forecast for the northwest Piedmont and foothills, including the Triad, Mount Airy, and surrounding areas. Freeze watch in effect from late Thursday night through Friday morning. Tonight, cloudy. Showers likely with a chance of thunderstorms this evening, then a chance of showers with a slight chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Much cooler with lows around 40. Southwest winds around 5 miles per hour, becoming northwest 10 to 15 miles per hour with gusts up to 25 miles per hour after midnight. Chance of rain 70%. Thursday, mostly sunny. A slight chance of showers in the morning. Breezy and much cooler with highs around 50. Northwest winds 15 to 20 miles per hour. Chance of rain 20%. Thursday night, clear, colder with lows in the upper 20s. Northwest winds 10 to 15 miles per hour with gusts up to 25 miles per hour. Friday, sunny, highs in the upper 40s. Northwest winds 10 to 15 miles per hour with gusts up to 25 miles per hour. Friday night, clear, cold with lows in the upper 20s. Northwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Saturday and Saturday night, clear, Highs in the upper 50s, lows in the upper 30s. Sunday, sunny, warmer with highs around 70. Sunday night and Monday, mostly clear. Lows in the mid 40s, highs in the lower 70s. Monday night and Tuesday, clear. Lows in the upper 40s, highs in the mid 70s. Tuesday night and Wednesday, mostly clear. Lows in the lower 50s, highs in the upper 70s. The forecast for the mountains, including Sparta. Wind advisory in effect from 8 p.m. this evening to 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time Thursday. For tonight, mostly cloudy with a 50% chance of rain showers. Breezy and much cooler with lows in the upper 20s. Northwest winds 15 to 25 miles an hour with gusts up to 40 miles an hour. For Thursday, mostly sunny and breezy. Much cooler with highs in the upper 30s. Northwest winds 15 to 25 miles an hour with gusts up to 40 miles an hour. For Thursday night, partly cloudy. Cold with lows in the lower 20s. Northwest winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 40 miles an hour. Wind chill values as low as 7 above. For Friday, sunny. Highs in the upper 30s. Northwest winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 35 miles an hour. Wind chill values as low as 5 above in the morning. For Friday night, clear. Lows in the mid-20s. Northwest winds 10 to 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 25 miles an hour. For Saturday, sunny. Not as cool times in the mid-50s. For Saturday night, clear. Not as cool as lows in the mid-30s. And for Sunday through Monday, mostly clear. Highs in the mid-60s. Lows in the lower 40s. The extended forecast for the mountains. For Sunday through Tuesday, mostly clear. Highs in the mid 60s. Lows in the lower 40s. And for Tuesday night and Wednesday, mostly clear. Lows in the upper 40s. Highs in the lower 70s. Here are the 4 p.m. observations for the region. At the Piedmont Triad Airport, light rain was falling. The temperature was 61 degrees, the 2.58, and the relative humidity 90%. The wind was out at 7 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.97 inches and falling. At Winston-Salem, light rain was falling. The temperature was 63 degrees, the 2.59, and the relative humidity 87%. The wind was out at 6 miles an hour. 
the pressure was 29.98 inches and falling. Elsewhere across the region to Dower, at Asheville, light rain was falling with a temperature of 60. At Jefferson, it was cloudy with a temperature of 59. At Mount Hill, it was cloudy. At Charlotte, light rain was falling with a temperature of 63. At Hickory, light rain was falling with a temperature of 62. At Burlington, light rain and fog were reported with a temperature of 62. At the Anvil, light rain was falling with a temperature of 63. In Raleigh, it was cloudy with a temperature of 72. At Wilmington, it was mostly sunny with a temperature of 80. Here is a public information statement from the National Weather Service. Today's regularly scheduled weekly NOAA weather radio test has been delayed as a result of active weather pushing into the region. The test has been rescheduled to 12 p.m. Thursday, April 1, 2021. The current time is 4.50 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Here is a special message from the National Weather Service for the following counties in North Carolina, Allegheny and Wilkes, and the following counties in Virginia, Carroll and Grayson. Wind advisory in effect from 8 p.m. this evening to 8 p.m. Thursday. What? Northwest winds 15 to 25 miles per hour with gusts up to 50 miles per hour expected. Where? Portions of southwest and west central Virginia, northwest North Carolina and southeast West Virginia. When? From 8 p.m. this evening to 8 p.m. Thursday. Here is a special message from the National Weather Service for the following counties in North Carolina, Alamance, Davidson, Forsyth, Gilbert and Randolph. Freeze watch in effect from late Thursday night through Friday morning. What? sub freezing temperatures in the upper 20s to lower 30s. Where? All of central North Carolina with the lowest temperatures in the northwest and the highest temperatures in the southeast. When? From late Thursday night through Friday morning. Impacts, frost and freeze conditions could kill crops, another sensitive vegetation and possibly damage unprotected outdoor plumbing. Additional details. Sub-freezing temperatures are expected again Saturday morning, with temperatures a few degrees lower than Friday morning. Take steps now to protect tender plants from the cold. To prevent freezing and possible bursting of outdoor water pipes, they should be wrapped, drained, or allowed to drip slowly. Those that have in ground sprinkler systems should drain them and cover above ground pipes to protect them from freezing. Now here is the hazardous weather outlook for Central North Carolina. For this afternoon and tonight, there is a marginal risk of severe thunderstorms this afternoon into the early evening as a strong cold front moves into the region. The main threat is locally damaging wind gusts. And now the extended outlook for the period Thursday through Tuesday. Please listen to NOAA Weather Radio or go to weather.gov on the internet for more information about the following hazards. Please watch late Thursday night through Friday morning. Much colder air will blow in behind the cold front Thursday into Friday. Sub-freezing low temperatures are likely both Thursday night and Friday night when low should be in the 20s. Fodder information statement. Fodder activation may be needed. The air quality forecast for Wednesday. A tribe of elements. Davidson, Forsyth, Gilbert, Randolph counties is 40 or code green. Air quality is expected to be good with the primary pollutant of small particulates. This is NOAA Weather Radio, All Hazards, Station WXL 42, operating on frequency 162.40 MHz. This program originates from the National Weather Service in Raleigh and is transmitted from an antenna located on Soratown Mountain in Phelps County. The station serves the northwest Piedmont and northern foothills of North Carolina, as well as adjacent Virginia counties. Here is the latest weather synopsis. 